Hi, in this video, Ask F5 shows you how to upgrade or update a big IP device. Updating or upgrading your software is an important part of keeping your system healthy and performing as it should. It also requires planning and preparation that is not covered in this video. This demo shows the basic steps in the big IP configuration utility performed on a standalone system. It doesn't cover planning, backup, preparation, prerequisites, downloading software, high availability considerations, or testing, which are covered in detail in the linked articles below. It's important that you familiarize yourself with these materials and perform any relevant prerequisites before performing the steps in this demo. Upload new software to your big IP system. First, log in to the configuration utility and go to System Software Management. You will see information about your currently installed Big IP image. In this demo, I will upgrade this device from Big IP 15.1.10.7 to Big IP 17.5.0, which I've already downloaded to my computer. To begin the import, select Import, then choose File. Browse to the location of the upgrade software image and open it. Select Import to upload it to the Big IP system. Install the software image. After the file is uploaded, under Available Images, select the checkbox next to the image that you want to install, then select Install. In the Install Software Image pop-up window, select the appropriate disk and volume. If you need to create a new volume, you can enter it here. For example, creating Volume 2 on the HD1 disk. Select Install and wait while the image installs. Note that progress for the install shows under Installed Images. If it doesn't appear, select to refresh the Image List tab. In the next step, we'll reboot the system. But if you're performing an upgrade on a standby system in a high availability configuration, you should first force the system offline so that it doesn't become active and disrupt traffic. Optional but recommended, force system to offline. To do this, go to Device Management Devices in the configuration utility of the standby Big IP system. Select the standby system, then select Force Offline. Confirm by clicking OK. Reboot the system to the newly upgraded software volume. In the configuration utility, go to System, Software Management, Boot Locations, and select the new boot location. Note that if you've made any changes to the configuration since installing the upgraded software, set Install Configuration to Yes. Otherwise, leave it as No and select Activate. In your browser pop-up, select OK to confirm that you want to reboot. Once you do this, the system immediately reboots. The system drops all existing connections and no traffic passes until the system completes the reboot and loads the Big IP configuration. To check if the update has installed, log in again to the configuration utility and go to System Configuration Device. Under Properties and Operations, check the version. Perform testing and troubleshooting as described in the earlier linked articles. And that's it. If you have any questions or comments, please send us a message. Thanks for watching.